Hello, my lovely Leo dragons. Welcome to your love reading for right now. So let's go ahead and get some cards. I had dealt them and I wasn't thinking. Sometimes I forget to hit the play button on my video. And so, and I pulled one and I was told, no, leave it. And I said, okay, well, I'm going to put it back in and we'll see if it comes out again. Okay. Because I was told, no, this is, has to be the one that stays out. So we'll see what happens. Okay. So like I said, I don't, Leo singles. So if you're part of a couple or if you're coupling energy, wait till I swipe this clean again. So it's just a quick little reading for where you are now. Okay, so trust came out. That isn't the card that came out the first time. So maybe I'm pulling a different energy. So, or we'll see. So this situation is calling for you to have faith. Actually, it does go with the other one. The other card that came out is release your ex. And I really feel, I wish I would have left it out now. Do you ever go shopping and you don't get something? And I'm not saying always to get something because I'm not a huge shopper. Um, as you can tell, because I'm always in like sweatshirts whenever I'm like doing my readings. But, um, but you sort of just, it's like, oh, I really wish I would have gotten that. And then even years later, you're like, I really wish I would have gotten that. I, that's the way I feel about this card. Okay. So the time has come to clear your energy. Okay. And you have to have trust that the situation is calling you. You need to let them go. Okay. So you guys are hanging on to something and it needs to be done. It has to be, um, it has to just be over with. It's done. It's dead. Okay. You got to let it go. Okay. It's gone. So that's pretty much it. So nope, that's too many cards. One more shuffle. I'm going to take over and under. Okay. Overall energy separation. So you are in separation from this person. Okay. Um, and you do need to let them, you need, do need to release them and let them go. Okay. So you, they're still in your energy very much. So you have a hand of cards. Um, I feel like you feel like it's taking a huge risk, but I feel like it's strategic. So I think that the reason why you haven't done what you need to do to release them, I don't know if it's energetically. I think that energetically and physically they're gone. Maybe deep down inside you're hanging on to something. Maybe you're stopping something from happening to finalize all of the separation that needs to happen. Um, because I think you think you're being strategic, but really, um, it's actually because you're really wanting them back again, but this is pretty, pretty over guys. So if you guys are dealing with a cancer, go watch the cancer couples reading, but this is single. So you guys are in the single energy, but you are hanging on to this X energy. That's why I don't think it's something love. Because usually when I have couples that are in separation hanging on, it comes out in the couples. This is single. So I think right now you're holding on to them in your energy because you're, yeah, you're hanging on for another reason and it isn't love. The Knight of Pentacles is the underlying. Yeah, it's to do with money. Totally. Okay. And I feel like, so you're waiting for good news and it's not happening fast. And it's because you're stopping everything from happening. I think it's just flying back in. Okay. I'm going to take that one. Yeah. Two of swords. You need to make a choice. Okay. You, you really, really, really need to sit and make a decision on what exactly you're going to do. Okay. You need to start something new. Okay. You need a forward plan. Okay, and you need a new direction. It's exactly what this is telling you. Okay, Leo singles, that's your quick reading. Okay, that's that's as much as you get because that's pretty much you don't need anything else. That's what you need to do. Okay, guys, that's it. Sometimes readings do just end like that because there's nothing more. Like, guys, move on. Okay, find a new direction. Let go of them. Okay, I feel like the universe has sort of like been screaming at you and you're just not listening. You're like, nope, nope. You'd rather live in, you'd rather live with not being happy. You'd rather live like, I feel like you're almost tormenting the other person. So, okay. Leo couples, true couples, please. I'd like to let go of all this energetically connected stuff. Oh, Leos who are coupled. I love this. Chances are if you're this though, you're not watching it, but that's okay. We'll do it anyways. 
true love. This is the romance of a lifetime. I love this. Okay, now it's not to say that it didn't come without any issues or any, you know, bumps in the along the way at all. But what I am saying is, is that like this is so beautiful, guys. So beautiful. told you one above one below after this I'm gonna take actually you know what there's one that flipped up let's see <laughs> not today <laughs> you guys having a little bit of some issues the problem with true love and being together in a couple is that sometimes you still have to live right you're so yeah you're mirroring each other Okay, guys, so you know that you're each other's love. You know that, okay? I feel like you might be avoiding a person. You might be avoiding them, though. For some reason, maybe you guys are in a little fight. Remember, these are just like a right now energy. This isn't, oh my gosh, you're in a big, huge thing. I get the feeling that just right now you guys are going through something, and that's okay. You're mirroring each other. Um, and... Um, I think that you guys are still perhaps working on some wounds together. Um, I'm getting the feeling that this isn't really a super new love, but I'm just getting the feeling that maybe it's Mercury retrograde. It's pulling back some past things that you guys need to work through together, or maybe you need to work through it on your own, right? So, but I'm really getting the feeling like it's, um, yeah. I don't get the feeling like it's a big, heavy energy. It's just the things, it's just the daily life things, okay? And especially, you know, in, with the past, you know, 18, 19, what is it, 20 months now that we've been like this? Yeah, so you might be reminiscing about old times, right? So thinking about, you know, you know, but I think what you need to bring in is a little bit of romance, okay? You need to uh, maybe get them something. You know, maybe you guys need to exchange some gifts right? Just show that you love them again, right? What's their love language? Yeah, and it's gonna, yeah. So strength came out. So you're just gonna, and guys, this is you, okay? You need to get with your beautiful, magnificent side, and you need to move towards, uh, towards the love, right? So, and maybe you just need to approach it in a different way. We get stuck in the ways that we deal with things, and sometimes, you know, and, and give it a chance, and maybe send them a little text message and say, listen, we're going to try something different, right? Because sometimes when you do go and try to do things, I've been in very long relationships, you go to try to, try to change a pattern, you try to do things, and they're, they don't know that it's coming, so then it's actually not met the way that we want it to be. We're expecting because we've changed our program that they're automatically going to change theirs, but they haven't because they didn't realize that we changed the program. They're still going in from that. So you need to stop the negative thinking, and you need to come in just fresh and new, okay? Maybe get them a gift. Maybe spend a night out on the town, okay? And just remember, so right now with the mirror, I feel like what you're putting out is what you're getting back, okay? So I think that you guys really just need to bring that in and sort of refocus on the relationship and on each other, okay? And think about what you're giving. Okay, Leo couple, still a beautiful reading, okay? Still a beautiful reading, nothing big, but just make sure that you buy them something Okay, it doesn't have to be big, just something meaningful, okay? And um, make sure that you, you know, communicate with them and let them know that you're changing the game plan. Okay, my lovely Leos, please like and subscribe, and I will see you next time. Thanks, guys.